I did not expect her to say <laughs> oh, this good. about Corey. So I got well, a question to ask you, and uh, just be honest with me. Would you vote for Corey? We're going to recognize our next guest, actor Ben Savage, star of the hit 90s sitcom Boy Meets World, has officially announced his candidacy for Congress. Savage is running as a Democrat to represent California's 30th district, which includes Hollywood. So joining us now as GMA3 exclusive interview is the man himself, congressional candidate Ben Savage. Ben, thanks so much. Welcome to GMA3. Thank you for having me. Nice to see you both. Good to see you. You are best known as an actor, but you studied political science at Stanford University, even interned for the late Senator Arlen Specter. You also ran for city council in West Hollywood as early as last year, as recently as last year. So tell us, what got you interested in politics? It's a great question. You know what? I, I grew up in a household that was very passionate about politics um, from a very young age. That was instilled upon us uh, as children. Um, I grew up in a household that revered RFK, um, that revered JFK. Um, when I first started running for politics, my mom gave me her um, John F. Kennedy button that she used to wear in elementary school, and I have that in my house now. And uh, I think it was just always instilled in us to stand up for our community and our country and uh, try and do the right thing on behalf of our community. So that's always been instilled in me. I'm very passionate about politics. I studied it in college, and uh, I'm really looking forward to giving back to the community and uh, standing up for what I think is right. And Ben, you Okay, I'm going to tell you why I would not vote for Corey. Oh, <laughs> okay. I, I, knew, I knew Ben when he was um, a child. He was a teenager, okay? And I don't believe that his parents brought him up to respect people properly, okay? Um, he caused a lot of tension for me on the set, and for other people, but for me, really being a little older, um, he did a lot of things that made me feel extremely uncomfortable. Now, let's cut to him being an adult. I didn't, when I met him on, as an adult later on when they did the sequel to the show, um, no, I didn't see any change in, in far as respecting people. As, and those are the things that I would, I would think would make good politics. I don't know his politics, and, and I would definitely not want to say anything to derail him or his achievements um, or what he's trying to do. You know, I, I, I really wish him the best of luck, and I want him uh, to be successful. But as far as my vote, no. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Woo, okay. Sorry, Corey. We, uh, we got to roll with uh, uh, Miss Trino on this one, bro. Golly. Okay. All right, so... Uh